Right now at 4.30, thousands of law enforcement members from around the country are arriving in town today. They're paying their respects to fallen Buffalo police officer Craig Lehner. He died during a training exercise on the Niagara River. Visitation hours are going on right now at the Lakeside Memorial Funeral Home in Hamburg. News 4's Ali Ingersoll is there live right now to tell us about the strong show of support. Ali. Hey, Christy, we've been seeing several officers from agencies all over Western New York coming in here saying their final goodbyes and paying respects to Buffalo Police Officer Craig Lehner. It's what we do. We take care of each other. Upwards of 10,000 law enforcement agency members from around the nation and Canada are expected to be at Officer Craig Lehner's calling hours and funeral service. It's hard when law enforcement loses a brother uh, in law enforcement, whether they're with your agency or in this case, Buffalo PD. During Wednesday's procession and service, outside agencies, including those from the New York State Police, are stepping up and performing duties around the city. So all members of the Buffalo Police Department can attend the officer ceremony. You come together as a family and you will help each other no matter what it takes to get your job done. We feel that we owe, you know, wherever we can, to the Buffalo Police Department and to Officer Lehner's family. The unity is strong no matter what uniform you're wearing. And their uniforms look a little different right now as law enforcement members from agencies all over are covering their badges as they're mourning, remembering, and honoring Officer Lehner. Until you walk in our shoes, you don't know what it's like. We're normal people that have families. We just want to go home at the end of the day. We could be in the same situation like that at any time. So when one of us is lost, killed in the line of duty, lost in the line of duty. We all suffer. We all feel the pain. We know the sacrifices they make and what they put on the line. So in an essence, we, we sort of virtually know each of these officers, and that's why it hits us, and it hurts us to go to these funerals. Well, a lot of the officers from the outside agencies who we've been speaking with tell us they didn't know Officer Lehner. They tell us they really do feel like they lost a brother, and they're vowing to continue standing up for him, remembering Officer Lehner and honoring his service and sacrifice. Reporting live from Hamburg, Ellie Ingers on News 4 at 4.